Well, have you wondered where we've been? Um, it's been a long month or so. There's been weather, of course, and that kept Ken from working on the tank. There's been traveling, um, having to go to out of town to visit family. Um, and then there's been a couple of um, medical issues, um, but everything is done. The travel went well. The medical issues are under control and um, weather is getting better. So Ken is back working on the tank again. Ken is putting on the outside layer of the uh, mesh wiring today. more wire going on to the tank. You'll have the wire done pretty soon. Well, I just picked some baby bok choy out of the garden. Um, we have three little plants here. Um, those will probably be the last for the season. Ken's going to put these little wire things over the end of the, over the top of the wire in the tank. You can see the little um, wire cages that Ken's putting over the top and he's got the um, laser up to make sure it's level so that it'll be level all around. actually pretty sturdy, isn't it? Yes, it is.
Watch your fingers. Uh -huh. They're very, very sharp. I know. We've got all the wire up on the tank. There is two layers on the outside. I don't know if you can see it, but uh, one layer, a quarter inch hardware cloth on the inside, and a second layer of chicken wire coming on the outside. And the inside core is 3 inch rebar. And uh, it's all ready to go. We might have a little bit of tweaking to do once we get started putting the concrete on it. We put the top cap on. And it's right here. And it needs to sit about a quarter inch from the top of the concrete. And that's where we got to set at. Oh, I forgot I have to go back and put my anchor bolts in yet, so I have a few of those to put in, but it's, it'll be ready shortly. And on the inside of the tank, we got this quarter inch hardware cloth all the way around inside, up and down, two layers. And it's going to make it really sturdy. This tank, when it's finished, will hold 3,000 gallons when it's full and once we get the concrete in and ready we'll start to put a roof on it but all in all she's ready to go next step is we build a movable form in here so when we start spraying we'll spray an eight foot section move the form and continue around until it's all done this is going to be approximately two to three inches of thick concrete that's all it is all it needs to do is cover the wire by a quarter inch. That's all the specifications call for. It's very strong. If you like what you're seeing, like and subscribe. Let us know in the comments if you want to think anything we should be changing. Thanks.